so it's been a while since I did a battle report. I have uh, been working on a new Warriors of Chaos army. I've been really painting that up as much as possible. And then I went to Nova, uh, the big Nova Fantasy GT. Played six games there. Uh, but I came back with a uh, pretty serious case of con crud and uh, had to wait to get over that. I think my voice is still a little hoarse. So anyway, this is my game one at Nova, in which I played Roger Yan. He was a really nice guy. I believe he's from the Baltimore, D.C. area. And uh, he was definitely, if, if we had done best opponent voting, he would have been a big contender for my best opponent of the weekend. Um, he's a ton of fun to play against. Um, so uh, it was game one, about 9.30 in the morning on Saturday, and you can kind of see in the first picture, this is really a mirror match of kind of two netlistish. Warriors Army. Um, so he, uh, I have the guys in, uh, that are in the red and blue down there. It's kind of a Night Lords themed Chaos Army. And he had a really cool Chaos Army. It was a uh, kind of chessboard themed. So it's all black and white. Uh, really cool. And it had a chessboard display board. So I'll run through his army really quick. Um, on the left there, he had a, a couple chariots, uh, Chaos Chariots, and he's got a Chimera. And then uh, he's got a uh, unit of skull, two, couple units of skull crushers there, a unit of marauder horsemen. He's got his demon prince, uh, two more chariots, and then his BSB is in that back right corner, kind of all in the middle. Uh, and you can see uh, his other, his uh, looks like another chimera and, and more chariots there on the left. So uh, fairly typical. Um, the going into this, I this is I guess my third or fourth game with Warriors of Chaos, and I, I really. I wasn't confident, especially in the mirror match. I, I really felt outmatched from the very beginning from deployment. So here we have my army. Um, on my left flank, got a unit of Chaos Hounds, two regular Chaos Chariots, Mark and Nurgle. Um, got a unit of Skull Crushers in the woods there. Uh, and then um, my BSP is on a disc. And you can see him in the, in the middle, bottom, along with my Demon Prince. Um, I have a uh, Gorby's Chariot. And the the fort the forty k model the fortreen mollerfine there is my uh, hell cannon. Behind it is a, and then on my right flank I've got another cast chariot unit of hounds and I've got ten cast warriors. So Nova was funny. The objectives in Nova there were lots of weird rules in Nova, um, and we're not going to get into too much. But uh, the the objectives you could uh, if you had unit strength five going from the seventh edition unit strength thing. You wanted to get extra points for capturing the opponent's deployment zone. Uh, there was a random building on the table that you had to capture as well. You got some bonus points for breaking your opponent, blood and glory style. And you got an extra bonus point for killing the opponent's general and for killing his largest uh, point unit. So in his first turn, uh, he moves up on my right flank with his uh, Chimera. And he, he pulls his uh, Marauder Horseman uh, forward. I think he's looking for me to charge them with my Skull Crushers. And he has, oh, he has a unit of dogs over here. I forgot. It's uh, actually cold ones that are painted white. And he moves them up as well. So first turn, I move these dogs up. And I'm not, I'm not looking to block his Chimera here because he can fly. Uh, what I'm actually looking to do is maybe sneak past. He'll ignore them because they're not a lot of points. He'll sneak past. The dogs will sneak past and uh, either take go, sit in his deployment zone or sit by that, that building there is the building that I'm supposed to get within a couple inches of and claim. Um, and I think I, I brought the toughness down on his uh, Marauder Cab. I think I made him toughness 1. And I'm, I have a Lore of Nurgle Demon Prince, level 5, or level 4 with an extra spell. And I'm hoping to uh, maybe just do the Magic Missile, D6 Strength 5. Uh, and have it go off. It repeats after he fails a toughness test, so I'm hoping it'll go off again and again, but I can't get that spell off. Um, I move my uh, Chimera. One of my Chimeras, I fly to the edge of this building, and I think that it, for some reason I was looking at the chariot, and I was, the buildings were impassable in this game, and or at this tournament, so I'm thinking that Chimera is safe, and for some reason I don't look at the Demon Prince and how he can just charge it. Uh, it's really dumb. Um, I did move the dogs up. Again, I'm hoping to maybe sneak him into his deployment zone if I can get past. Uh, oh, and I, um, I actually charged his dogs and, and uh, caused them to run. Um, and he moves his stuff up. 
He's kind of getting up in my grill a little bit. Moves his BSB onto my uh, right flank. Moves his skull crushers forward. And his demon prince comes forward. Um, and he also. Yeah, he moves the chariot. And yeah, he takes that Marauder Cav unit and puts them right in front of the Skull Crusher. So I have no choice at this point. I've I've honestly just been getting outplayed a little bit here. Not not comfortable in my own skin. So uh, he charge uses Demon Prince and he charges my Chimera, and it's an easy charge to Demon Prince. And I so I flee with the Chimera. And I know the Chimera has a little chance of uh, of uh, maybe rallying. It's not great, but it's you know, possible, but it had no chance of standing up to the Demon Prince one-on-one, -on -one, so it takes off. So in my turn, I have, a, I have a couple chariots to charge. I get off some chariot charges and cause his, uh, one of his chariots to flee. And, uh, yeah, I'm forced to, I, I'm redirecting at this point in the Demon Prince, but I'm trying to put two chariots in the Demon Prince, maybe knock a couple wounds off of it, and then if I get a chance, I can I can shoot it with the Hell Cannon or get that Demon Prince into combat if he's down a couple wounds. Maybe that's doable at that point. I think Impact Hits have a decent chance. Not a great chance, but I don't know. Nothing has a really great chance to wound the Demon Prince, but this is worth a shot, and it's going to get rid of the Charm Shield. So I'm willing to take a slight risk to maybe do one or two wounds if I can. I charge the Skull Crushers into his Marauder Horseman. I have no choice. This is really ugly for me because I'm going to overrun and it's uh, going to be dumb. And I charge the Chimera and my BSB into his Skull Crusher. So fairly confident about this one. I've got a Strength 7 Great Weapon BSB and uh, the Chimera can eat up some Skull Crushers as well. So I have, I have hopes here. One Chariot makes it into the Demon Prince, so that's that sucks. And uh, you can see his Chariots rally back there. Yeah, he's got more fleeing. The dogs continue to flee. Um, I'm shooting at these guys with the Hell Cannon, trying to get because uh, out of his leadership. Some of them are out of his leadership, and I'm just trying to get uh, get something going with that. Um, and I do a couple wounds. To, I, I just don't do enough to these Skull Crushers. It's really sad. Um, I kind of end up sitting there instead. And I really thought that uh, with the strength four, strength six, and strength seven attacks. Uh, I could really do a lot of damage, and I don't. And you see, he kills. Uh, he drives past my dog here. Oh, he got yeah, charged the Chimera. Tried to redirect, failed. Uh, chimera leaves the board, and uh, he's he's gonna have an opportunity to turn here. And he gets uh, his BSB starts munching on chariots in the back. That's no good. And yeah, you can see this is this is a trap I fell into. He's got skull crushers and the chimera into uh, into my um, skull crushers, and then he's got his demon prince into the side of my chimera. I was really hoping they'd have blown past, uh, but oh well. And yeah, the the BSB and the chimera are gonna have a lot more trouble with the demon prince in the flank. Um, so yeah, they they get eaten up. They run away and they get caught, which is sad for me. He runs down, uh, runs down the Chimera over there. He's, <laughs> Gorby's Chariot is actually just uh, fighting the BSB and just takes like one wound around. It's uh, the Gorby's Chariot was really I was a big fan of the, the whole tournament. Uh, he continues to yeah, he's smashing up. This Chimera on the flank has smashed the warriors and the dogs. Uh, my Chariot charges into the flank of his. Uh, Flank of his skull crushers, but it's really at this point to no avail. 